In this video, you are going to discover how modern concrete block machines turn raw materials into finished concrete blocks. And by the end of this video, you will have witnessed how these innovative machines streamline the process of turning cement, stone dust, aggregates and water into concrete blocks ready to build houses. Basically, the concept of concrete block making machine is entirely based on the concept of vibration and compaction. The major materials required when making concrete blocks are cement, stone dust, 3 8 aggregates and water. The first step is adding stone dust or aggregates into the batching machine. There are two kinds of stone dust, one called mix and another called smooth. Mix has both larger particles and smaller particles, whereas smooth only has small particles. When making hollow blocks in this batch box, we add four flat wheelbarrows of mixed type stone dust and two flat wheelbarrows of smooth type stone dust to make the total as six. Six are taken at each time. Then on the other hand, when making solid blocks, we add 3 8 aggregates instead of smooth stone dust because we want higher density of the blocks since they are used for load bearing applications. This ratio is just a general guideline depending on specific requirements of your blocks and the machine you are using. You may adjust slightly, always follow the manufacturer's recommendations for your particular machine for the best results. The second step is to transport the stone dust to the mixer using the conveyor belt. Here at the mixer, we add half bag of cement in the six flat wheelbarrows of stone dust. Water is added automatically to the required consistency. We are using little cement when making hollow blocks because they are used for non-load bearing applications and when making solid blocks, we have to add a lot of cement because solid blocks are used for load bearing applications. You have to note that the cement that we purchase when making concrete blocks is the one with an R, not the one with an N. R denotes rapid strength and setting fast, whereas N denotes standard strength and slow setting. So you must buy the one with an R for quick setting. The third step is transporting the wet mix to the compactor or vibrator using the conveyor belt. Inside here, the wet mix is vibrated and compacted under pressure to remove the air voids. The machine uses molds that are specifically designed to create different types and sizes of concrete blocks. For example, this is the mold for hollow blocks and this is the mold for solid blocks. The fourth step is producing the concrete blocks. Concrete blocks are produced from here, placed on the pallet and taken outside for drying and curing and also to do the hardening. Water has to be sprinkled on the concrete blocks to harden them and also to avoid any cracks. After around two days of initial hardening, stack the concrete blocks in a gazetted place while still curing them for the next two weeks. Lastly, they can be transported to site to build the walls. That's all about how to make concrete blocks by machine. I hope you get something from it. If this video was helpful to you in any way, kindly hit that subscribe button. I would really really appreciate. Thank you so much for watching.